Welcome to another Let's Play brought to you by Podcast 17. I am William. Today we're going to be playing Other Life Hatch 18. Got this off Planet Philip. It was released on August 30th, 2012, so we're a little bit late. <laughs> I'm about a month and a half late. It's made by AASC, which is the uh, the dudes who do like this this sort of, I don't know, fringe slash J.J. Abrams slash uh, Lost meets Half-Life series. You see, like, their Sarma stuff, all sorts of crazy stuff, if you're into the J.J. Abrams TV shows. Anyway, this is Other Life, chap uh, Hatch 18, chap only Chapter 1, Forgotten Passenger. Um, the other chapters aren't finished yet, I guess, so we're going to check it out, um, and uh, we'll see what happens. Sorry about uh, the last Let's Play. I guess the audio levels were all messed up. The, the microphone was really low. I just did some testing. Hopefully this one's better. Um, but uh, but I did test it, so so hopefully it's, it's pretty good. And this is the first time I'm recording with my new SSD, so I'm actually writing these directly to my SSD. We'll see how that works out. Hopefully I don't fill it up too quickly. Hopefully it's not over 300 gigs. Sometimes these Let's Plays, like raw video, gets over 300 gigs. It's crazy. Um, but here we go. Anyway, let's let's sit back and watch the show. The transportation. All right. Do I have to go poop first? I've pooped. I'm ready. Prisoners from Block 7A are being got on the train number 18 bound for 7, yeah, City 17. Okay, same thing says up there. Same thing. Eastern Siberia City 24, Nova Simulsk Prison. Cool. I like it when they really get into different canon, like when the, when developers try to get into canon, I should say, and try to like cover the other cities. You don't see that enough. Oh, I love little cart rides. These things are so badass. I got no mouse look though. Or free look, I should say. Pretty boring ride. Really wish this would hurry up. Am I on the train now? Our universe has an infinite number of versions. Some of them can be easily called parallel because the progress of events is very similar in them. On the other hand, some are so different that we consider them alternate worlds. Differences between the very versions consist in historical details, places, and situations. For example, there can be a version of our planet where the USSR didn't disintegrate in 1991. Each event draws a chain of other events so that the march of history can be completely changed and the technical progress of one universe will lead beyond progress again another same day, month, year, and any time unit. Whew. That thing scrolled really fast. I couldn't read it dramatically. This is the story about one of them. About the parallel universe, which is known as Other Life. So wait, this isn't canon then. This is a different universe from from our, from the Half-Life Universe. 
37 days before Gordon Freeman's arrival to City 17 train station. Oh shit. Okay. Other life, Hatch 18. Wouldn't it be funny if this was called Utter Life? That'd be funny. It was a story about a cow. Oh, my head. Oh, cool. We like crashed in the Left 4 Dead universe. Do you want to open the document? Oh my god, there's like little stories here. Okay. Used for transportation of political prisoners. Destination City 17. Destination of the Load, Nova Prospect. Members of an illegal. Load is members of an illegal movement. All of them are people. All of them are especially dangerous and are liable. Annihilation in case of escape. Oh, I see. Or to be killed in case they escape. Mission. Take the prisoners of City 17 and get onto the train bound to Novus Prospect where they will be questioned. Existence of this train and its mission is top secret. Okay. Gotcha. There's some shotgun shells here and some bullets. Alarm! The prisoners have escaped! Guards must immediately annihilate the runaways without legal investigation. Annihilate! That's awesome! Not even like detain or kill, just just annihilate. Blow them to little bits. No questions. This is cool. I'm ducking right now, I can't stand, so... Oh, maybe I have to pull this out? Looks like a grate or something. There we go. Move this out of the way here. These trains are very cramped. So I said, oh, ha, ha. Right. There we go. I don't have a flashlight or anything, so it makes it a little bit more difficult, but I'll survive. And apparently I also needed health. Door is unlocked. All right, good. Received one message from Central Headquarters of Rail Transportation. Read the message. We received the signal that the train has crashed. Additional detachments and equipment have been sent to you. You must stand guard over the load until the reinforcements arrive. If the load makes an attempt to escape, kill them. That should really say annihilate them. Some of you must find out the reasons and consequences of the crash. We have no versions why this incident occurred. <laughs> so the information about it is to be ready before the auxiliary detachments arrive. Ammo for the gun I don't have. Alright. Let's escape! 2018, Eastern Europe, not far from City 17. Cool. Let's get the fuck out of here! This is pretty nice. Oh shit. Oh, don't go that way. Bad way to go. Um. Oh god. I don't know where to go. No, don't kill me. This is really hard. I won't go back in the train. I'll be a good person. Oh my god, I'm gonna die here. Okay, we're gonna run for it. Oh, I'm dead. Shit. Okay, this time we're just gonna rush him. I didn't really see an exit. Oh. oh, that's not good. This is definitely not the right way to go. Oh, it's like flipped and stuff, too. Okay. You have to run backwards or something. I don't know. Maybe up here? 
Oh, over here. Here we go. Run! Okay, we figured it out. Go this way. I can't actually sprint because I don't have a suit or anything. Get on top of the train! I can't! Get on top of the train! Oh my god, this is a dead end. A little confusing. Take your fucking... Damn it. Okay. Not that way. Don't run into the dead end. This is a wonderful experiment of trial and error. There we go. Light on. Run through this thing. Go down here. Maybe run this way? Aha! Yeah, they're not gonna find me down here. Oh jeez. Oh, that mouth is very scary. Oh, shit sticks. Use emergency shutting of thermal gates or something. Oh, this button. Close the gate! You shall not pa- oh, fuck. All right, we're safe for now. Station 12. Is there a way we can turn on the lights? Oh, it's in Russian, I can't read Russian. It's all in Russian. I read. I would like a weapon though. Oh, here we go. What's this? We're jamming. Oh, it's locked or something. You need a memory block to launch communication terminal. Start puzzling switches. That always works. All right. Um, let's see here. Cool music, bro. Oh, okay. This thing's acting now. Device initialization. 1, 2, 3, 4, 5, 6, 7, 8, 9, 10. Communication channel 17 is available. Okay, cool. Incoming message. Hey, can you read this? I hope you can, because right now this is the only way to contact me. There are some temporary problems with sound equipment, so you can't hear me. And I can't hear you. What? But I can hear you. Anyway. But you can read my text message. Oh, and I can see you because there are so many cameras in this hatch. Yes, I've noticed you on the screens. Here's a camera. Okay. Got it. Okay. I read the message. Thank you. Okay. I suppose that you're the last prisoner from the Combine train headed to the 17, aren't you? Well, the answer is obvious. Sorry that we didn't find you earlier. We didn't have much time because we weren't ready for the train crash. We had to act quickly and evacuate most, almost all passengers. Except me, you dicks. You left me here in this weird room with some crazy Russian music that I don't understand. And I don't even have a fucking weapon yet. You keep giving me all this ammo. I have two news for you. Traditionally, one is good and the other is bad. The good news. Now you're at the station of the resistance of the Combine, which is situated within an old Soviet bomb shelter. Those hermetical doors that you slammed in the face of those Combines are a serious obstacle. You've won some time. This guy probably also thinks I'm illiterate, because... Or he types very slow. I can't even move. Normally I'd be jumping on beds or something right now. 
And now the bad news. Not much time. This shelter was safe, but time didn't spare it. Can you see that reach through hole above you? No. At least there is no welcome doormat near it. It's only a matter of time before the combine lock. Oh, that one. Lock down and get to your location. Okay, so we don't want them jumping through that hole. Gotcha. Uh, just let me solve the puzzles. God damn it. That's not all. The detachment that you saw on the surface wasn't going to arrest you and lead back to the train. They conducted a cleanup operation. They shoot to kill, or they shot to kill you a few minutes ago. Even now, although I can contact you, you're alone, face to face with enemies. Okay. Oh, I just blew that can up. That must have been a fringe event. Oh, I can move all these boxes. But that doesn't mean that there's no way out. Our group is on the other side of the mountain. We're going to leave. I'm just a singular, but I can stay here, help you get over the mountain and find my car. At the moment, my help is your only option to get alive and stay alive or whatever. Fucking stop talking. God damn it. So you can leave the shelter, but first you'll need a flashlight and something else because it's dark above the ground. Way of moon, I'll open the storehouse where you can find something useful. Fantastic. Thank you very much. Am I free now? Oh god, I'm not even free yet. Oh, just let me go. Am I stuck in something? Oh, for fuck's sakes. Does this work? Yep, alright. Fuck you. Oh, this is kinda cool. It's like a radiation detector. Whoa! What the fuck was that? Oh, the observer's on fringe. Cool. Now you have a small shoulder mount camera and a transmitter. Only with the help of this equipment we can remain in contact. Take care of yourself or you'll be stuck here forever or the combine will find you. Okay, cool. I want this box. Break the box. Apparently that's not gonna break. How do I get out of here? Okay, now reach the second level of the shelter and find the emergency exit. It's a large green iron hermetical door. You can't miss it. On the way to the second level, you'll also see a locked door. The key was somewhere near, somewhere on the first floor of the shelter. Be nice if I can get out of the first little storage room. God, you love locking me in places. I think I'm, like, literally stuck in here. Oh, there we go. Finally. Thank God. All right, find a key. Gotcha. You can use a flashlight in dark places. That's the door we came from. Oh, this is the... I hope there isn't scary things. I don't like scary things. There's a gnome here. I don't know if there's supposed to be a key in here. all fun and games until there's monsters. I don't think there's a fucking key in here. God damn it. Okay. Oh, is that a key? That looks like a key, doesn't it?
Hmm. Where are all the keys? I feel like I'm playing Anna. If you guys haven't watched my Let's Play of Anna, that's an awesome game. Oh, this is annoying as shit. Everything's locked. I'm gonna look for the key and uh, I'll be back. Oh shit, it was actually just, there's now this is all lit up. It wasn't lit up before. You saw it. Okay, there we go. We got the key. Doop, doop, doop. Okay, can we open? No, the key doesn't go in there. The key goes in here. Whoa. Okay. Oh my god, it's bright in here. I think there's ghosts. don't know what we're looking for. Oh, this thing, the communications cube. Or something. That must be the door out. There we go. Alright! Do you want to read... Or, do you want to read the last sent message? Yes. From Station 12 to White Forest, sent today. I'm reporting that our detachment leaves Station 12. After search in the record combines, prison trains, and cleanup of a few guards, we begin evacuating the prisoners. Fortunately, no one was killed. According to the documentation of the train, we evacuated all of them, almost all. Only one person hasn't been found. We're short of time because according to the combines communication server, another detachment will arrive soon. We suppose that this detachment will excel that one that was in the train in strengths and arms. Okay. The Combines don't want anyone to escape. They even have an order to kill everyone without investigation. We'll try to evacuate through the technical area and then use an old underground collector where we've hidden the transport. Okay, so technical area, old underground collector. We have no time to take the equipment, so we'll leave it, including the memory blocks of the communication terminals in conventional secret places. Okay, now what? Great, thanks. Thanks for leaving me behind, dicks. Oh, is this thing open now? There we go. You'll have to open this door to go further. It's lock always gets stuck, so look for a short pipe or something like that. Okay, no problem. Let me go. I would like to look for this short pipe. But instead, I am fixated on the messages. When you're finished with the door, come out. You'll find yourself in the industrial area of the former research institute, which was situated here before the Seven Hour War. There, go there. Go between the buildings and reach the flank of the mountain. There's an old tunnel through the mountain. It's easy to reach. At the other end, within a kilometer, you'll find my car. All right, that's a lot of shit to do. Uh, industrial institute between the buildings, flank the mountain, old tunnel, car. Sorry for my bad manners. I didn't introduce myself at once. You can ha you can hardly care about manners after you luckily avoided death, though. Well, my name is Murphy. I was a signaler at this rebel station. Okay. Hello, Murphy. My name is William. And with me today are all my subscribers on YouTube. Well, I have to disconnect you. Thank Christ! Because this area can be scanned by the Combine, and I don't want them to read the messages. Be careful in the industrial area. We left it an hour ago, so the Combines can be there. Now, moreover, there are lots of head crabs in this area, and they're very dangerous at night. Alright, whatever. Look at See, my character moves. He's moving. 
that's probably how I got stuck last time. He's slowly sliding into the wall and stuff. This time I didn't get stuck. Alright, so we're going to have to find a pipe. I found a pipe down here earlier. I remember it. It was right. Booyah! Oh, this is open now. Oh god. What was that? It's kind of creepy. There's some combine somewhere. I know it. Oh, they're dropping them down here, maybe. I was really hoping I'd get a weapon. Apparently not. I'm really hoping this game sort of ramps up. Um, so far, it's been a lot of read this. Find this stupid shit. Do all these other things. Oh god, that'll probably alert a lot of combine. Use reinforcement to break them. I can use this pry bar, I guess. Looks like it caved in. Can't go that way. This is a cool vent, though. I kind of like this. Pretty creepy, actually. There's something on the line. Can't understand it. Okay, it's locked. Go there in a second. What's this? Great! The only the only choice is door number one. All oh, these lights are so bright. Sort of. No. Jam it in there. I don't even know what I'm 
I'm doing anymore. Let's see if I can rotate it. Oh, that actually worked. <laughs> Okay, so we got two communication channels now, 17 and 18. Just when you thought it could get bad. Oh my god, I thought you were done talking to me. Welcome to Object 18. Now you're e now you're beyond the area of the combine scanning, so I can send messages with the threat of being found by them. You should go around this multi-story brick building. There should be a passage for motor transport, and behind it, you'll see the garages. All right. This is kind of a nice looking area, though, if it wasn't cluttered by the fucking text. This looks like the way to go. Oh, you motherfuckers. Don't worry about the posters telling horror stories. We've checked everything. Radiation level in this area is normal. There are some suspicious, suspicious sealed doors, but every even near them, the counter doesn't even show large numbers. The few warnings about radiations are fake. Probably they were printed to scare away the civilians. Great. Oh, there's a radiation symbol. Like, I'm not trying to rush the game, I'm just trying to fucking play it. It looks pretty cool, though. This is a combine lock, sorry, the image is very dark. I can't so I can't say it seems the combine started their operation. I haven't seen this lock before. It means that we have to change plans. Come back to the fork and road turn left. They're trying to find our arms service. We've already taken most of the weapons, but you may find something there for you. It's just over there. Come on. Come on. That's kind of cool. This button. Finally. There's a hunter here. Okay, hide amongst the vegetation, but be very attentive because you aren't the only one. Clip. Clever, uh, only clever one. Head crabs who are vulnerable in open fields like tall grass and total darkness. These monsters can easily become a thorn in your side. Be careful in the tall grass. This might get a little difficult if all I have is a pistol. I don't know what's going on. Apparently I made the dude angry. 
And all the Combine Gnome here and all these headcrabs came out of nowhere. originally actually music's kind of nice god damn it where are you what the fuck okay they're like invisible now we're dealing with invisible head crabs Fantastic. Oh, come on. Great. Great. Okay. I need a key, apparently. We can find a key. Hidden in the yard where you saw the monument to Lenin. Look for it near the checkpoint and please don't destroy anything more. Noise of the iron ladder that hit the ga gas bottle. Where is he? Okay, we gotta go back to that Lenin statue. No problem. Screw it. <laughs> okay, key. Where is the key? Kalu a uh, key. There's no key. I'm looking for like a flashy white border. I just get it? I don't know. I think I did. Okay, I'm down to one health. Great. This is retarded, because half the time I can't even see that grass. Okay. Locked door. Okay, good. Now we need to go get health. I fucking hate this! I don't know where he went. I know he's in here. Alright. Rush. Don't stop running. God damn it. Uh, I'm gonna punch a monitor in the face.
Oh my god. Okay, we're gonna get up here. I'll be safe. No more head crabs. Never had such a problem with head crabs in my life. There we go. Now we're making babies. Something here that I can't get into. Some more combine? Really? There's just one? Hunters fighting the fast zombies. And I'm caught in the middle. Okay, I'm going for it. Nope, not going for it. Just kidding. Don't charge me. They probably were just on duty. Most of them are now patrolling the area. The faster you cope with the combine force field, the safer you'll be. I think it's less dangerous inside the hatch. All right. How do we open the combine force field? Uh, my massive dynamic. I get it because I watched the TV. Oh, wait, what did I just do? Okay, here. Something happened. Combine force field system. Um, okay. Unlock all the fields. Did I unlock it? No. No. It says that one's locked, this one's unlocked. Oh, I get it. Okay. Okay, so I pulled that thingy. So now do I go back here? There we go. Cotro! That must be... Everybody's unlocked. I don't know what I did. Just push some buttons. Huzzah!
These hatches are creepy. They certainly do a really good job at it, though. Use the emergency shutting, it's on your right. Oh, this side. I use the emergency shutting. Oh. Now what? Now we're stuck. Sorry for the short delay, now you have a really big problem, because that was your only way out. As you notice, the Combine have already made an ambush there. Most probably they hunt not only for you, but they think that some prisoners may still be here. Well, I am a prisoner, so... They are hunting for me? I don't get it. Anyway. Okay, good, thank you. Thanks for the info. Can we go now? Listen, you better hide somewhere. You're safe behind the hermetical gates. But just in case, there's a storehouse behind the other door. The lights aren't working, by the way. Hide there and wait for my message. I have to change places because my car is within a kilometer from the very exit where the combine set the trap. Mm -hmm. Alright, so let me out. I can do this with seven health. There we go. Finally. Alright. Maybe he means this thing? Oh, maybe down here. I think he means this. Nope, maybe not. Okay, he meant a room without lights. This room has lots of light. Hide here and wait for Murphy to contact you. Okay, this is me hiding. There's an invisible head grab somewhere. Walter, what the fuck? Like out of the storage room, please.
This is as painful. Wow, this is fun. Hope you guys are enjoying this. I know I sure as fuck am. I'm probably missing something. There's probably something I can do in here. There's gotta be. All these bricks fell. That's kind of creepy. Because I tried picking them up earlier and I couldn't. What do I do with the bricks? Oh, fuck me! God damn it. I don't like this shit. Get me out of the creepy room now. Are you alive? Move the camera a little. Alright, I changed my location to further... And moved further from the dangerous place. Now I can write to you again. Well, I have an idea how to take you out. But it is a risky one. Although you have no other way, it is the only worthwhile plan. Just get me out of the creepy room, dude. This was not a fun experience. Holy bananas. Have I told you that before the Combine Invasion there's a Russian scientific complex here? No shit! I didn't live in these places, but I've heard that earlier this territory belonged to the USSR during Cold War with the USA, lots of scientific and military organizations appeared, some produced boards for rockets, some created new weapons. Boards for rockets. That sounds awesome. I'm just picturing like an MDF board, like a board of plywood or something attached to a rocket and some dude just surfing it through space. We became interested in this place because one Soviet laboratory was situated here. It is known as Object 18 and had the same reputation as the American Area 51. People say that new technologies were designed here or developed here. The Russians were going to weaponize them as well as use them in space exploration with their rocket boards. Dude skateboarding through space. That's so cool. The Russians are badass. Okay. Let me out. No, not yet. You're not done talking. It is known that the USSR had an international scientific and military organization which worked almost in all countries of the Comca, like the Pentagon's Black Mesa. Object 18 was like a central office of this organization. Archives of all the projects, Soviet and international, were kept there. I think, I got a theory, okay? I think this guy has no friends in life, so he sets up these elaborate things, kind of like Saw and traps people in this room with this communicator so that the only thing they can do is listen to this guy talk because he has this urge. But an incident occurred and everything was sealed. Fake warnings about radiation appeared. The object was under protection until the seven hour war. We think that they protected something very important. After the combine invasion was abandoned, we came here to get into the sealed facilities and look for something useful there. At least some information which could remain in the archives. Well, what is useful for you, you can leave the object using its communication. What? I don't know what that means. Well, what is useful for you, you can leave the object using its communication.
After search in offices on the surface, I've got a plan of underground complex and several exits are marked on it. You can go through the top levels of the object and find another way out. It's rather risky because the track is unbeaten, but it's worth trying. If things go wrong, you can keep a low profile there. I don't know what the fuck this guy's saying. We tried to make a passage and it was almost completed, but we had to stop the work because of the train crash. To find our breach, you need to get on the lower level and find a hole in the wall. Be careful, everything there is in disrepair. On your way, you'll have to make a gap in another wall. It isn't as strong as it may seem. Okay, I'm totally not understanding what is going to be happening, but I'm sure I'll figure it out. For now, I'm cleaning up the creepy room. All this stuff needs to be shoved in the back. Oh, thank Christ. Okay, here we go. Can we go this way? Oh, I bet you we go down here now. Call this. Ooh, finally. Ooh, and a crowbar. They're being awfully generous in this section. This is kind of look, looking cool. This looks really cool. And then this is the wall in the middle. playing Minecraft. Only with bad guys. I'm stuck. Oh, okay. It's so dark here. I think this is the place. You're on the first level of Object 18. There are 29 floors under you. Oh my god. A rather impressive number. They were building it for years. However, now everything is in ruins. Oh. Obek. Obek. Obek number 18. creepy down here. Oh, I saw something move. I'm done. I'm done. No more gaming. No, I gotta keep going. For the sake of the last play. An arrow! It seems that you aren't the first visitor after so many years of conservation. I wonder if your predecessor came through the gap above. Well, you need to reach the elevator shaft to find a way to the fire escape which leads to the top. If the entry is buried, try walking through the technical areas of the elevator shaft. You'll have to cross that shaft somehow. Not digging this dude. Not digging the creepiness of the whole thing going on here. I was not told this was a scary game. I wonder why we haven't seen this gap earlier. We wasted our time clearing the debris when there was a hole here. Maybe this gap was hidden with the vegetation above. We haven't noticed it. You guys just suck. You need a key. Doop a doop a doo. Gonna find a key. Bet you it's right there. These are the wrong keys. Of course they are. That would be crazy if they were the wrong keys. Oh, motherfucks. Oh, I guess that's it. Oh, thank God, because I don't think I could have taken any more scary. I'm kind of glad it was over there. Um, overall, I guess it's a nice precursor to something more exciting. It's got sort of a fear atmosphere to it, and I think they're going to make like a pretty long campaign out of this if they keep going. Um, but if I were to rate this as just, you know what, 
an isolated experience, not part of something grander, not very good, but uh, you have to remember that there's probably going to be many, many more chapters to come, so we got that to look forward to, and uh, I will play them as they're released. Only chapter one is out right now, and I don't know how long it took them to do that, so maybe we won't see thing, anything for a couple months, who knows? Um, but until then, this has been another Let's Play brought to you by Podcast 17. Thank you for watching, and I'll see you guys next time.